be 100% honest, if you told me this at the beginning of the year, I would have laughed and been like, really? The majority of the soccer world would have had the same reaction if you said that at the beginning of the season that the Cougs would make the NCAA tournaments elite eight. This Friday marks the program's first ever appearance in the tournament's third weekend. I caught up with the team as they attempt to make history once again. No one likes an underdog to be winning like this. For the NCAA Women's Soccer Tournament, only the top 16 teams of the 64 team field are seeded. As WSU Soccer heads into the Elite Eight, they're the only squad left without a number next to their name. We've raised the standard. We've showed people all over the country, hey, WSU Cougar Soccer is one to play and one to go against. We're not going to get outworked by anybody, and uh, we're going to roll the up every day. The staff and the players go to work. If you've watched a second of their play during this NCAA tournament run, you know that this team hasn't been afraid of anyone they've encountered, including scoring three goals against number one seeded Virginia, a team who had only allowed eight goals all season coming into the matchup. We just believe in ourselves. I think that's really all that I have to say. We know that we're a good team, and once we have a good game plan or we execute it properly, that it's we just know it's going to go good. We all have that mentality that we're not going to stop, and who cares who we're playing? We might not be better, but if we can fight and continue to press and do the things that we know how to do, we can come out with a win, and we're not scared of anyone. The Cougs once again take that attitude into a game on paper many people wouldn't give them a chance in, taking on number two seeded South Carolina. I mean, the girls, the girls eat that up. I mean, Cougs are underdog. At some point, those underdog days will be done, so we're going to keep riding while we got it. What's the goal against South Carolina? To <laughs> win. <laughs> no matter what happens on Friday, though, this team will always hold a place in WSU history. There's something to be said about enjoying the moment as well. It's amazing. It's I can't, I can't even put it into words. I'm like speechless about it because it's something I, I've always dreamed of as a little girl, making it to the Elite Eight, Final Four, anything like anything like that has always been a dream of mine, and I'm living it right now. So it's kind of crazy to think about. It seems like you just can't stop smiling. You just <laughs> I'm excited. I've never been in this position before. <laughs> WSU and South Carolina face off at 3 p.m. on Friday, and you can find it online on SCC Network Plus. So, yes, Cougs fans, it is required to have two screens going during the Apple Cup this year. That's it for sports. We'll be right back.